So we're gonna be swapping diffs with the homie. Uh, I love how Toyota just decided to do the big axle uh, Allens, but should be pretty straightforward. Shop today? Cool. Home to drive to my shop and then clock out at my shop. Yeah. So we got fucking axles done. And the bitch has drive shaft working on it. That 19 shouldn't be too bad, but. Nah, that should zip right off. Yeah. Should. But In who, theory. Yeah, I mean, who knows when last time this was fucking done? Never. Yeah, Never. He got the, the old diff. I got this diff. Because I need the long gear. He need a short gear, boy. And uh, I just took these off and said doing the X on there. And I need to redo those bushings because those are uh, seen better days. But other than that, pretty straightforward. Get the poly upgrade. And uh, did you die? No, I'm still Okay, high. okay. Yeah, that's how you know she's good and moist. But I need to do the subframes at some point on the bushings. And hopefully the motor in like a month. And these 10 Allens are retarded, but thank you, Toyota. And then the rear 12s are the same, right? Yeah. Yeah. 12s instead of 10s. Not sure. Thanks, Very many thank yous. Alrighty, so we didn't really get to report too much because uh, it got late and we both, I got to go to work in a bit and he has some stuff to do. He had to grind his bolt a little bit because my diff was a little bit longer on the uh, head, but kind of the after the fact. So new diff is in, everything's bolted down. We do have the polyurethane mounts now. I need to get these two replaced in the rear because they are probably OEM 30 years old, but... Pretty straightforward on how to do this. Uh, it's these are T12s, one there, two here, and then these are T10s. So these Allens right here are T10 bolts or Allens, and then those are 19s on that, and those are 15 or 16 depending on what you have. So, um, yeah. So we'll just take those off. We did loosen the sway bar from here. Uh, you can also loosen it on the end link as well. We just decided to drop it from here. And it made it a little bit easier because it just drops out the way so you can get those out. Um, and yeah, so everything went pretty smoothly. Like I said, we kind of started recording and then just wanted to bang it out and just get it done. So uh, everything's back together. Fortunately, I can't, well, I can't test my car uh, because... Uh, the motor should be done in about three weeks getting a belt block put in so that will be fun probably get this thing back on the street and test the new diff uh for gearing should be a lot better because it was short as hell before and now it should be where it's supposed to um i'm gonna get probably new wheel and tire set up just because these have been on the car I like the front fimit the rear is a little sunk in so um probably go a little bit bigger or just better offset. These are 18 by 9 and 10. I'll probably do the same with just better offset because the rear plus 50. But front fits good. Uh, eventually I'll get better coilovers. These are in TN Masters. Um, oh yeah, so that needs to go forward a little bit. So, but besides that, the clearance is pretty decent. So, yeah. So, we'll be chilling there, but... Um, I was debating on doing the rear brake, the 15 conversion, um, that black part actually came off when I was tuning because the, uh, what was it, uh, the charge pipe on the intercooler just blasted off at like 23 PSI and then knocked that out with it, so have that, have the old one right up there actually, um, but yeah, so we'll get all this sorted out and this thing will be back hopefully by the end of June. 
I'm excited. I do need to pay for tags. Um, but yeah, I'll probably get that painted, the front bumper. I have a lot of little flaws on the car that I know, but probably just do that. Maybe do the doors. Uh, I need to redo the headlights. The front bumper I need to redo. has a little rock chip. I drove this to Vegas and back three times, so it's a driver's car. It's not a collector's or anything like that. It's going to get driven. It's not going to be super, super pretty, but it's it does the job pretty well. Uh, black carpet for the interior I'm put in this I need to fix the actual glass part of the mirror just have it taped for now but um, I'll take that off and get actual paint or not paint actual glue for the mirror and now that I'm in a house instead of an apartment I can do all that so that is pretty much it for this one so diff is in should be good to go and yeah that's gonna be it for this one that wasn't very step by step but we were trying to just knock it out as quick as we could since our deadlines are coming up pretty quickly um but yeah i want to do a video on the super since it's been mainly the z the bikes and all that good stuff um so yeah that is it i'm tired but I go take a nap so like share comment subscribe this is more of like a kind of update than a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do it but hopefully you enjoyed it nonetheless and yeah that's gonna be it for this one